catch up on her live streams though um in between everything um yeah i do normal stuff like i'm an actual person i'm not a robot um, <laughs> <laughs> i don't feel like i used to do you, do you um, feel like you just had thyroid surgery <laughs> no but i don't feel like i used to <laughs> um, is Melinda, that Melinda, is that you? Joke. You know it's gonna so, be a wacky Friday when Scam makes jokes. <laughs> it is. It is. <laughs> um, so um, the thing is, I have um, a lot of messages and emails and Discord stuff that I have to do still because I was, you know, doing adult stuff today. Um, and uh, Polly and I have a plan to have a little phone call to nice. go over some things and um, kind of prepare some stuff. Yes. Um, so that way, when we go live, when we live stream later on, um, things can be a little bit more organized, and I can go through your emails and all of that. Um, yeah, love till the end. Once a box, real quick. Yep, sure. Let's. Um, you have to request. You have to request. Yeah, so I don't want to stay on live real long right now because me and Polly need to convene and get yes. some things um, organized. Um, yes. We're trying to look after ourselves, but yeah, we have to kind of, you know, go through some stuff. I do have some updates. Uh, let me see if your request is there. Okay, gotcha. Love till the end. How are y'all? hey good hey. how are you good i was in there just watching they and messaging people there was a lot more in there saying no than there was helping so i think it's working guys yay that's good that's good i mean you can definitely tell that we're um we're making effort it's getting more difficult for her to get money um and um you know she keeps having to change around her payment methods and things like that um, we're getting more and more messages back of people that are being open and honest and uh, receptive, I should say, open and receptive to when we send messages. Thank you, Ms. Yeah. Lovely. And last um, night, and last night, the full, four of my message actually came into y'all's live. Right. Watch. That's so. awesome. That's awesome. So That's we're awesome. getting the word out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, mean, I, do, working. I do believe she's at her at her end. I hate to say that one way or another, something's going to happen. I agree. I agree with you completely. The way she's talking, she's either going to break down and get a, get the help or the other's going to happen. Unfortunately. Yep. And I also, I also think that the intercept accounts are helping. Um, and even though there are some people that are criticizing about that and they're trying to imply that the people running the intercept accounts are keeping the money or that I'm somehow keeping the money when I don't even run any of the intercept accounts, I don't um, even know they're how not they aware work. of, they're right? not, well, they're they not don't have even, anything to do with that. The thing is that wasn't even like our idea. Yeah. Um, and I'm not going to say whose idea it was, but it was a good idea. It is a good idea. Mm -hmm. Um, and that did not come from us. No, um, it didn't come so, from us actually at all. Um, and you'd be surprised who it did come from. Yes. And so, um, you know, it's a good idea. And um, these people, um, you know, they can prove that they've returned all the money. You know, if they wouldn't send yeah. me the screenshots to prove that they returned all the money, um, we'd be happy to show that. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I, I'm not running any of the intercept accounts. I'm not certainly keeping any money and no one else is either. No one is interested in doing that here. No, um, I don't know why, uh, you know, people that accuse that kind of stuff are usually the people that actually do that kind of stuff themselves. Exactly. Yeah, you no know what I mean? It's kind of like when you're in a relationship and you're faithful and your spouse keeps saying, or significant other keeps saying, Oh, you know, keeps accusing you of cheating. And then you find out they're the ones that were cheating the whole damn time. Yes. You know what I mean? Because guilty they're ones. the ones that are doing it. They're the ones that are doing the bad stuff. So they think that everybody else is doing bad stuff. It's like, no, you're the one doing the bad stuff and you're trying to accuse someone else. Okay. Yeah. So, um, you know, yeah, people a word who are for making that. these false accusations yeah. Those, are the, yeah, people that are making the false accusations are the ones that actually do that stuff or would be willing to do that stuff. And I stand right. on that 100 percent. I, I do, too. too. I do, too. And I think it's funny how people try to control 
how we decide to do the platform. <laughs> so can I can I jump in here real quick? Here's my yeah. question about the intercept accounts. Who the fuck are you to tell anybody what to do? No shit. We can do whatever we want. They can do whatever they want. You can do whatever they want. And if you don't <laughs> like it, you can literally go eat a sandwich and hug a pillow like Happy <laughs> says. Yes. Yep. That's good. Exactly. And it's crazy that, like, Nicholas wants a box. It's crazy that um, that we're being told, told <laughs> to turn off our gifts and stop collecting money for charity. Right, because then that proves that then you're really in there for the person you're covering, right? Right. Like, if they want to do their own research, they can, but a lot of people are just like sheep and listen. So real fast, can I have the floor for a second? Because mm -hmm. I want to say happy Friday to everybody. Thank you. Also, I want to say happy that... Friday. At Explain in Detail, got a job today. Yes. Yeah. Very proud of her. She got the job she wanted. She Congratulations. Did. Explain. She did. And so I wanted to bring attention so proud to that of you. Because I'm also looking for a job. Um, but, you know, whatever. But I wanted to kind of, um, you know, bring that to light and the fact that she, we were. Anyway, I'm not going to go further because I don't know if I can say anything further. But um, also, yes, I appreciate all of you, right? And um, you don't, I, this is new to me with all these gifts. So I'm like, oh my gosh, when I send one rose at a time, I'm like, please don't, please don't feel the need to say thank you. Keep, thank you. Thank you. I'm like, one thank you is enough. And I'll just keep trying to like, you know, get it up there because I love uh, what you guys do. And also, I forget anything else, but I, I felt like I wanted to kind of be the voice of um, her and saying she got the job. And we were there with her little drug test and, you know, and she was so great and she was doing lots of things and it's a great Friday. So I just wanted to bring light to that, that's all. Thank you so much, Pete. Appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. congratulations to Explain. And there was somebody, Lana, um, that said her husband just got a, jo a job as well that he um, he just found out. So congratulations to him. Oh, yay. So, Great party news. Oh, Good I'm so yeah. sorry. Amanda, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, Amanda said that her husband just passed away. Oh, oh Amanda. I'm so sorry, Amanda. Oh, that's so sad. I'm so sorry. So sorry. No. So sorry. Oh, Stan, one more thing. Amanda, I am so sorry. I've been no, not. I know the feeling, girl. It's I'm tough. I'm not supposed to be oh, sorry. sorry. Um, but did you hear that the court this morning was for the dog and Lisa didn't appear? Yeah, I didn't know that anything was scheduled for today. I was going to look back on the docket, but again, I haven't had a chance to do that because I've been busy all day. I don't um, believe that's true. There is no date on the docket. There's absolutely no upcoming court yeah. calendar, nothing. I didn't I didn't see anything on the docket, so I don't know no, if that's that's true. not true. Okay. Um, I was going to double check that. I mean, she, there was there was court doc documents. So okay, Breezy. I'm not going to go through emails right now, though, because I can't. Like, I... They're literally so disor. I've. We I've have received a lot to do. You guys have no idea how much we have to do. Oh my god! I probably received like two hundred emails just since last night. So I need to get something organized yeah. as to what things I need to cover online, things that I need to investigate behind the scenes, and yes. and all of that. Okay, thank There's you. I sign up to be your secretary. <laughs> <laughs> Nicholas, you'd be an excellent secretary, actually. I, I do work customer service on the computer, so I totally could. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's. I would love that. Actually, you know, um, I have hundreds of mails right now to return. Hundreds. Yeah. Hundreds. <laughs> I don't have time. I, Who has time I in the day? I don't also, know what time anybody, we're gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna plug myself out there. Um, anybody that has connections with doing remote work, customer service, account manager, I'm your girl. So 
I'm looking for a job. Just gonna plug myself a little bit out there, but message me. Sorry if it's not allowed, but yeah. Um, don't have any money to be paying anybody, but thank you. No, it's okay, but I'm like, I'm struggling. Um, I have so. coins. Does that yeah, work? Yeah, I mean, a lot of the stuff that I'm doing has to be done by myself. Thank you, Trouble, because I have to check um, my TikTok accounts and things like that, and you're not able oh, to like darn. get in there and check them because some of their accounts are private, and yes. a lot of the emails I have to respond to individually because some things are like, again, it's not information that's going out to everyone and things like that. So thank you, Terry. Thank you, Sassy. Um, somebody um, wanted a, um, an update about Jace. If you want to um, say anything else you want to say, Nicholas, um, I actually got a message while we were here live streaming and I'm going to forward it to my other phone really quick so I can make sure that I'm relaying things properly. things <laughs> everybody does we love I think explaining details the only one that doesn't <laughs> <laughs> all right so um i had um you know i've been speaking with um thank you amanda um and they the, the person may um be here um hopefully um i had inquired more um as to whether there was any knowledge about um, the clinic situation and um, the visits with Jace. And if you recall, um, Lisa was supposed to have visits with Jace um, on Tuesday, and she was a no show for that. Um, and then she was, she canceled, and then she rescheduled it for Wednesday, but then she canceled that one. And then um, she had one scheduled for yesterday and she no showed for that one. Um, she was um, reported to the Department of Public Welfare for still collecting food stamps. And um, someone had asked Jace what the best part of being at his new placement was, which is with his paternal grandparents. And um, he said food. Yeah, isn't that sad? Um, thank you for the gifts. Um, yeah, poor kid. Um, because I, you know, I, I don't know if you recall, but just recently, you know, she was trying to show that she didn't have food in the refrigerator and she had eggs and people were saying, well, why don't you cook some eggs? And she said, I, doesn't, I don't have a frying pan. Like, like it's, I don't, what? I don't really think she was ever really cooking for him. Oh yeah. She said, I can't cook eggs because I don't have a frying pan or a pot or anything. Like, how do you not have those basic things? And if she did need those basic things, why wasn't she ever begging for that? Or why didn't she ever put that on a, on a Amazon wish list? You know, a couple pots or pans or something. Well, she doesn't like, I, don't, I, don't, I don't get it. Um, you know, I don't really think he was getting home cooked meals and I'm sure he probably is now. Um, oh. so um, I'm glad he, yeah, I'm glad he's in a, a better place and he's being well taken care of and, and everything. Yeah. Um, and, um, uh, let me see. Um, give me a second. I'm just going through my screenshots of my messages here. Oh, so sad, honestly. Ugh. Right. Um, the, the, so the no show for the, the no show for yesterday's visit, um, she was supposed to text the caseworker if she wasn't coming, um, you know, to at least give them notice because the, um, you know, his new guardian or guardians, um, whichever the case may be, have to take him to the CPS office and, um, you know, meet up with her. And um, they go there and they wait and she doesn't show up sometimes and, and doesn't even cancel. So they're, they're kind of dragging him down there and taking time out of their schedule and, and going there and just sitting there and waiting. And then she just doesn't show up a lot of the time. Um, so they, they had told her, um, if you're going to cancel, you have to text the caseworker um, in advance to let us know. You know, and they probably gave her a time frame, like you need to cancel like two hours before. I'm just giving an example. You know what I'm saying? So that way they know not to go there. Um, 
And um, so yesterday, um, she was a no-show again, and she never called to, or she never texted the caseworker to let them know that she wasn't coming again. Um, given up, it seems like. I don't know, uh, you know, and they and they they took him down there, and um, she was a no-show. Um, let me see what other information. Um, I don't know about PA, but South Carolina, they have three chances of not showing after that. They stop the meetings because of the child well, being so upset. Well, um, I, I did say it's, it's um, you know, sad because when people were asking her um, about visits with Jace, um, you know, she just yells and says, don't talk about my kids. Well, um, I was informed that the reason she probably doesn't discuss him though too is that cps told her she's not allowed to talk about jace or cole at all yeah um so that's why when people bring up you know the children she's saying don't bring up my kids don't bring up my kids because she could actually uh, you know i don't know she's been told not to, to speak on them thank you random yeah. um and um Let me see. Um, I really appreciate this person providing me with this information. Um, and, and she had missed what happened with Lisa today um, about the whole clinic situation. And um, she, she did say, I can't tell you this enough. You are one awesome person. So I appreciate that person telling me this um, yeah, and for the, you know, the information they're providing and, um, they said that from their understanding that going forward, oh, thank you, Rachel. Um, so her, their understanding yes. now is that going forward, because now she's canceled and no-showed several times, thank you, um, Lisa is now to contact the CPS worker if she wants to see him. Yes. Um, so if she does want to see him, um, you know, and have a supervised visit, they're they're not gonna they're not being proactive in the scheduling visits for her to continually not show up. She needs to contact CPS and make arrangements to do that now because of so many times of canceling and not showing. <clears throat> and um, there is another court um, date scheduled for July, and um, when that happens, um, CPS is going to be letting the court know everything that's been going on. Um, and Jace has told the CPS worker that he does not want to ever go back to her. That's right. And um, he was more annoyed with her wasting his time by not calling to cancel um, than not seeing her, you know. Um, again, because they're taking out their time, effort, sitting around and waiting and, and things like that. Um, waiting around at the meeting office um, where they were supposed to meet up and, um, you know, just doesn't show up. Sometimes she doesn't cancel. She says she's coming and then and schedules it and then, you know, just doesn't show up. Mm -hmm. um, he was more upset about, it seemed like he was more ups, upset about the inconvenience of having to go through all of that um, than the fact of not um, seeing her. Um, so, yeah, that is sad for him, but the good news is that, um, you know, he he seems to be still doing well, um, and he's definitely in a better place. Mm -hmm. That is what I would assume why he would not want to go back to that household, um, Lisa's household at this time. Um, it, it seems like things are just so much better for him, and yeah, good for him. Um, he is a really smart kid. Mm -hmm. Um, and, um, you know, as much as there were times that we would hear him, um, you know, at times angry or, or saying things, um, disrespectful things to Lisa and all of that. Mm -hmm. Um, it doesn't seem that he's doing any of that now. I mean, the whole thing was, you know, he was, he was a victim of neglect and abuse in that household. Yeah, exactly. And, uh, and he was speaking up and he was acting out and i think now that reactive he's in a better, abuse yeah and now reactive that he's in a better abuse. place um you know now that he's in a better place it doesn't seem like that's happening mm -hmm. um so good on him and good on 
his new guardians, um, good on his grandparents mm -hmm. for um, making sure he's well taken care of. I'm, I'm just, I'm really happy that he's in a better place. And I know there's some people that um, think that Lisa, you know, should get custody back of Jace. Um, but um, I don't really think that that's going to happen anytime soon. And I don't think that it should happen anytime soon, honestly. No, um, no. She's not even trying. She's not even no. trying to get better. She's not trying to clean her house. She's not trying to acquire employment, treatment, uh, any kind of a semblance of a normal life whatsoever. She's not providing anything for him. She's not even providing the bare minimum, which is a mattress. Yeah, like, and she's been given she resources to get free, free mattresses and, and all of that. Yeah, you just um, have to make the phone calls and do the work. Yeah, and uh, um, um, she did... Uh, I don't know when the last... I don't really think she's seen him since the day she went to court. I don't think that she has... Well, no, she went to one scheduled visit. She went to one scheduled visit. I want to say it was maybe two or three weeks ago, and it was supposed to be two hours, but it only lasted about an hour. Jace cut it off early and didn't really want to stay the whole two-hour visit. Um, and so I think that's the last she's seen him. I know she did try to call him on Monday in the morning, um, I think maybe around 9.45 in the morning approximately, and um, Jace said that he was busy with schoolwork and he hung up on her. And, and you know, he's, <laughs> he unfortunately, like he had a lot of things to make up with with school and try to catch up so that he um, would still pass his current grade um, because she, because of her, he missed 28 days of his cyber school in a row, um, as well as probably some other days here and there as well. Yeah, that was the first visit, and it was also the last visit. Um, yeah, I'm not checking messages right now. I will go over messages later. I already went through that explanation. I'm sorry if you missed it. Because I have too many messages to go through right now. I need to get a bunch of things organized, and I need to respond to some people that are um, some important messages as well. So I will go through all of my messages, um, and I can go through some some things when we go live later. Oh, I don't scary. know that he's a year behind. Me and Polly have an amazing idea. I think uh, we have to we have to get together the three of us. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. But right now we're really on busy. It said she said video. What? Just he said she said video. I don't know what that means. She got a call back from DCYF. Who? I'm so confused by some of the comments. I'm sorry. I'm. But you're not the only one. <laughs> yeah, I'm like. Can't they do truancy? Yes. And she's gotten charges for truancy before in the past, a couple of years ago. Um, and I'm not sure if it was for Jace or if it was for um, some of the other children because they were a number of years ago. But she's had truancy charges two or three times in the past where she had to pay fines and things like that. Um, I don't know. I'm just looking at the comments. Yeah. Ask Dirty about the dental meds. What? What? No, we're not, we don't even care about that. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh, a dirty laundry? Oh, okay, Shaka. I, <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> Lisa yeah, was I'm kicked confused. out of the clinic. Oh, Raggedy T posted about her being kicked out of the clinic or whatever. Okay. Yeah, but I don't see that that's a fact. Yeah. I mean, uh, I think that's still speculation. Exactly. Um, she said she was, I mean, she said she was kicked out, but yet she's still been going there now for a couple of days. Apparently, and then, and then it she, takes time to be transferred right. out. Well, I mean, the time will tell. That's all still speculation. She's still been going to the same place since then. Um, look for an email. 
I don't know why I, I need to check my emails right this moment. Is this something really that urgent? Because I really wanted to take time to go through them. Like, <laughs> my goodness. Um, I forgot what I was even going to say now. <laughs> the chat's going like, wild. Yeah. Uh, I, it is. <laughs> really? Um, Cassie wants the box. clinic were okay. you saying were you saying uh check your emails now because of what i posted about your email i don't know people in the comments were saying check your email check your email check your email and oh I'm like, okay uh, i posted you have a video in your email but i didn't mean for you to check it right oh. now oh oh no there's a whole bunch of people saying that okay yeah. there's there's a, rebecca that's a, rebecca, there that's a, a video hmm? so i was replying to somebody in the comments I'm oh, sorry. Okay. No, no, no. There is a video in your email, like I told you on Disco. Um, it appears to be, I, I don't know, because I don't know the, I didn't do any investigating, but she appears to work at the clinic and talks about the fact that Lisa is going to be released. So I, I don't know that somebody could um, give that information out. Yeah, that sounds like a HIPAA violation to me. That's highly illegal. Yeah. Yeah. I, and that's why I like to review this stuff before I just show it on live, because it might not be real. Agreed. Do you know what I mean? Agreed. That's why I <laughs> sent it to your email. Yeah, that's why I like some of the stuff I like to check beforehand and sort through. I just wanted um, to make so, sure you didn't think I was telling you to check your email. No, no. Yeah, there's just a bunch of people all saying, check your email, check your email, check your email. And I'm like, okay. um, yeah, I'm going to, after I end the, end the live stream, I'm not going to do it like right <laughs> a second. <laughs> See, we have a fake tattoos and Cadillacs account in here. Yeah, I'm letting them live a little bit. Let them have some fun because we know who it is. Oh, <laughs> My goodness. Yeah, thank you. Hi there. Um, but, but just a, a final thing about the whole, you know, clinic thing. Um, you know, she's saying that they're closed tomorrow, which is strange to me because, um, first of all, if the clinic was going to be closed, um, they would have notified them about that way far in advance. Like they would notify people that the clinic's going to be closed. Uh huh. Number two, she yeah, says, "Oh, well, I don't, I don't." Number two, she says, "Well, I don't know why they're closed. I don't know. I don't understand it. I don't know why they're closed." Well, you were just there today and found out they were going to be closed. Like, why wouldn't you ask somebody? Like, if they gave you your dose for tomorrow, why wouldn't you be like, "Why were you closed tomorrow? Why are you giving me my dose to take home with me for tomorrow? This is weird." Like, why? I mean, you know, doesn't like a common sense thing say you would be like, "Why are y'all closed tomorrow?" You know. Um, and third, when she said they were closed tomorrow about when she talked about it, she said, yeah, yeah, yeah. They gave me, they're closed tomorrow and they gave me my dose for tomorrow. Well, why didn't she mention her dose for Sunday? Like she only was mentioning, yeah, they gave me my dose for tomorrow. They gave me my dose for tomorrow. Wouldn't they give you both your doses Saturday and Sunday? She only right. made it seem like she got one. Right. She would have two. Hi. You know what I mean? Like, so... I don't know like it it just it doesn't make sense to me um yeah. something's still not right about all of this i don't know exactly what it is i don't know if maybe it's that they are open and she's just lying about it but i don't know what her angle would be for saying that because you know there always gotta be an like angle, fish, right? it's fish. yeah maybe she did get kicked and they gave her doses and now monday she starts in a new place you know yeah she does lie about everything it, it's yeah. just but sometimes there's a little bit of truth to it too so but i'm just trying to figure out what her angle would be about about lying about the clinic being closed tomorrow like what would she, her she said that tomorrow uh, is the pride parade but the pride okay. parade last weekend she said it was because of the pride parade that's what I people said, were, that's that's what i heard through other people that's what she said in the live i guess i don't know i wasn't there for that live when i heard the live she was saying that she didn't know why i heard her saying i don't know why they're closed i have no idea 
Um, I just saw the signs on the door today. Like I had no idea they were closed and I don't know why. And I'm thinking, well, why wouldn't you ask somebody? Right. Um, so I don't, if she's lying about this again, there has to be an angle, but I can't figure out what the angle is. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Again, I'm going to go through my messages. I'm going to go through my emails and everything that people send in. Maybe there's some other perspectives or some other information that um, I can find out. But to me, the whole thing seems fishy. Uh, someone in the comments said about pride. So, I mean, again, that could just be a rumor. I did not hear Lisa say that. I did not hear Lisa, Lisa no say idea. that. I have no idea. I didn't hear anything about that. No, me either. Me either. Um, yeah, so, I don't know. Um, like I said, me and Polly are going to have a little meetup over the yes. phone, little conference call. And um, we're going to go through some, through some things. And hopefully by the time we go live next, we will have some things um, organized for you guys. Yes. Let's hope. <laughs> Let's hope. Let's hope. Uh, what did you miss? I'm not sure. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> our brains are much at this what point. What did I miss? It's like I don't know where where you're at. Like I don't know what you what you are up to date on or and not. Um, my my uh, best suggestion is if you're behind in watching your streams today, is to go to Nuki Fifty One Fifty or to Kai Fati YouTube and yeah. catch up on the live streams. Uh, we just watched her, you know, live, but she was only on for a little bit, not very long. Um, but I did catch up on the live streams from this morning. Um, the thing that could be a HIPAA violation would be if someone works at the clinic and does like a video about stuff. Well, that's a definite Possibly. HIPAA I violation. Again, I haven't, I haven't seen it yet. I don't know what information's given out. Thank you, cream pie. Um, Thank you. I have to, I, I don't know. Somebody supposedly sent me a video. I haven't watched it yet. Um, maybe that'll give some more insight. Thank, Thank you, Cream Pie. I appreciate you. Um, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do that. Polly and I are gonna do what we're gonna do behind the scenes. Yes. And uh hopefully by the time we come back, we will have things a little bit organized and have some other content and information to go through. So yeah. Rebecca says, but I need to tell y'all something. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> We'll never get oh, look, out the of fake here. tattoos are sending you gifts, tattoos. Oh, fake thank you. you. I'll be sure to I'll be sure to insert that money into a claw machine just for you, bud. Uh, I SDH, I do not know the exact time. Like I have probably I have hundreds of emails and messages, so oh, I don't sweet. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what time. I'm sorry. Like I'm going to try to get through as much as I can. I really am. Um, probably at least two to three hours. Unless Lisa comes back on, we'll hop back on and we can go through some stuff. Maybe um, that we have together. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, buddy. First. <laughs> Come on, send me a galaxy. Actually, send you know what? Send the universe. Send the universe. Go ahead. I dare I you. I want that red carpet thing. You can throw me some um, corgis. Mercedes, some of my lives are posted on Kai Fatsi's YouTube, but not all of them. Um, I could upload them to my YouTube channel, and this I do. I do have a couple on there, but slam. um, I I have not had time to upload like every single live stream onto YouTube because there are there's so many and if they end up being more than three to four hours they're really difficult to upload and um to download from TikTok and then upload them to youtube so i have no idea who young low and narrowly are <laughs> look at you getting spicy it says <laughs> Hold on. It says a bazillion videos, including text. It has. What's it? You mean the fake accounts? I mean, if they're talking about the fake accounts, we're aware of all those. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, I already had dinner. I made me some um, 
chicken fried rice and um, egg rolls. Nice. Yeah, but I made it at home. It wasn't Chinese takeout stuff. I, I made it myself. Oh, that sounds good. It was good. Thank you, Deborah. Ooh. That was cool. It was cool. So um, any other final questions that I can clarify before we, I'm sure we'll have more, sure, uh, love till the end. We'll go through stuff. Ooh, chipotle, pork fried rice, yum, love it. Say this with my daughter, I missed, oop, this comment went away. Mr. Live oh, talking thank about. You, save that God's grace. Oh, thank you, Save. Oh, I'm sorry, Jody. She had, she sent in a story, I guess, to me. Yeah, it is better at home. Oh, I got more cookies. I got more cookies. Don't worry about that. I got cookies too. I got yeah. I got. <laughs> I had a Walmart delivery. Yeah, yes. right. Thirteen. Oh, Very God. exciting. Um. Where was somebody else said they had oh love to the M once box can okay. Ooh, barbecue pork chops, corn on the cob. Mm. Hey, I was just gonna Yum. ask real quick because when um tattoos was in the box with uh Jeff yesterday, you couldn't hear nothing because Jeff wouldn't everybody was hollering over him. What were y'all talking about? A rug test for him to do online or something? Yeah. Thank you, Jeff. Okay. Correct. Did he do it? No. Okay. I didn't know. Like I said, everybody was hollering over it, so I couldn't hear nothing. No, no. He, uh, <laughs> first he claimed he, <clears throat> I told him I would send them to a lab, and then they all complained that the labs were going to be closed. And I, we found that CVS has a 10 panel. I would have the door dashed right to his, to his hotel room. And they once again deflected away from it, so. Go figure, right? He's not going to do it. Yeah, yeah, his his cheerleaders his cheerleaders was telling him not to do that. Yeah. All kind of women in there hollering for him. I was like, what the heck? <laughs> I don't get it. God, to the show, right? We got fun and games. These must be some old I mean, this guy people. is dusty, he is crusty, he has no ambition. He's always got sleep in his eyes, his hands are filthy, he's gonna give you bacterial vaginosis. Like, you know, that's going to be a thing. Like, why does anyone want to date this guy? Polly, I was like, oh, they must be really old and desperate. That's yes, all I can see. say. I don't think it has anything to do with age. I think it's just to do with desperation. Something. <laughs> oh, he has BB for all. <laughs> if you're it dating Jeff. <laughs> um, Sherry says, someone in Lisa's live said we're giving you over 200 a week we can't keep up with this what wait what where's that coming from <laughs> <laughs> what wow. the fuck what 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 prove it <laughs> prove, prove it. it exactly prove it I love how everybody says they have receipts and proof of shit but yet never fucking show it <laughs> It's so true. <laughs> so over it. It's ridiculous. Yep. And um, one other thing, you know, like there's stuff being posted about our little Discord and all of that. You know, if anybody in here doesn't want to be part of the Discord, nobody's forcing you to be in it. It's free. Uh -oh. A lot of us are having fun over there. Yes. Um, I'm not pressed, as they say, nor do I care if you know, stuff is being posted from our Discord elsewhere. It's really creepy to me to do that. Um, right? But if that's what they want to do and that's what their content is, I think that's really strange um, yeah. and creepy. But, you know, if that's what they want their content to be, um, to build it off of my Discord, I mean, yeah, okay, um, I... I'm I'm inundated with requests. Like I think like actually more people want to join the Discord now um because they think it looks like a lot of fun. So, yeah, yeah, keep keep posting stuff from the disco. Like um right? We're actually having a blast in there. <laughs> I I'm I'm inundated with um with requests. Um it's disco is Discord. Um if you want to join it, um then um 
you just email me at scamslam411. I'm sorry, scamslam411 at gmail.com. Thank you, Deborah. Scamslam411 at gmail.com. And I'm always reminding people, you know, not to post personal things about themselves in there. Don't post any of your own, you know, personal name information, you know, too much personal information about your family or your job or anything like that, because people yeah. can, you know, um, try to um, maybe do something with that information. Um, and you never know who might sneak in there. Um, but um, I mean, we're having fun with it. Um, Right. I haven't seen anything that's really all that concerning. So, yeah, don't say anything you wouldn't say publicly. That is a perfect statement, sugar, sugar. Don't say anything you wouldn't say publicly or don't say anything that you want want to, you know, get put into a TikTok video. <laughs> right. So so one of the one of the one of the words that Florida man uses is the word foul. So now yeah. we know that it's you, Mr. Florida man, you jelly, you jelly. You want to be my zaddy? What's up, baby boy? <laughs> he wants to be your claw machine owner. Uh, I, I mean, that, that's some Robin Hood type shit right there. He takes it from Walmart and sells them to small stores. <laughs> but yeah, we have, um, you know, we have a, a voice chat in there, and um, and we all we all go in there. You can you can talk to us and chit chat. Um, sometimes we have unofficial little watch parties. Thank you, Ashton. Um, we have unofficial little watch parties in there, um, and um, we have little chats in there, and you can talk with us and ask us questions and have private discussions with us and stuff like that um, on the voice chat channels. So um, you do have to be, um, you do have to have at least 200 followers and be following all three of my accounts, mm -hmm. and um, and then you can email me for the invite and um and then you would um have to message me with your TikTok account screen um your you know screenshot of your information send it to me on discord not to my email because i need to be able to link up your TikTok account to which proper discord username you're using um because there are a lot of usernames that are similar like for instance there are like you know maybe six different Michelles, you know, so I need to know which Michelle <laughs> goes through, um, you know, is linked to which account. So, yeah. Yes, I'm still going through a lot of verifications. Uh, Polly and I are going to be working on some of those as well when we um, have yes. our phone call here in a little bit. She's going to help yes. me with some of those. Mm -hmm. It's not hard to learn disco. And if you need help, you can just post in the general chat and um and say hey how do i how do i do this you know how do i send a message or how do i reply or how do i send those funny you know meme gift things that you're posting how do i do that people will um will help you you know yeah and people and for some you. reason i can't find the freaking voice chat anymore so like whoever messed with it if they could put it back <laughs> well, we, can, uh, we have a we have a chat in there that we can discuss. Yeah, all we'll do that, that with the person. Yeah, you would need to send an email to get the invite. I send you a link um, with an inv invitation, and I believe it's good for 24, 48 hours. So you do need to kind of click on it um, promptly, and then um, follow the steps that are in the email. You know, just message me on Discord with your TikTok username. So, yeah, that is it. Yeah, and if you have ideas for channels, you can message me. Um, I have, yeah, you can email me. If you have ideas for new channels, for new scammers to cover, I'm making a list of those. I'm not adding any right now because my first priority is trying to get the existing members approved and invitations out and all of that. But in time, we are going to be adding some more channels of some additional scan scammers. How does the voice chat work? There's a separate channel that you go into. And when you go into there, there could be, if there's other, it'll show you who else is in there and you can join in the chat. When you go in, your microphone is going to be on. So when you first go into there, they're going to be able to hear anything you're saying or doing. So if you want to be muted and just listen to what people are saying, when you first get in there, there's a little microphone button at the bottom that you can press to mute yourself. And you can kind of listen to 
what's going on and what other people are talking about. And then you can unmute when you want to say something and then mute again when you want to, you know, not talk, you know, yeah, you just awesome. turn it off and on, um, turn it off and on when you want to speak. Um, and again, there's some watch parties that go on in there where maybe we watch somebody on TikTok. Um, we watch, yeah, just like here, we might watch a live yeah. stream on TikTok and we can have a conversation about it over there in the Discord and live stream. So, yeah, it's fun. And share really fun memes. Time. It's fun. Yeah. And you can, you, your name doesn't have to be your TikTok name. And you can change your name and your picture and all of that. You don't have to put any personal stuff or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. people need to mute. Yeah, when you're, unmute when you're talking and then remute when you're not talking because everybody, it's not every bunch of people are trying to um, talk all at the same time. Yeah, you're right. Saved by God's grace is kind of like that. And you don't have to talk. There's some people that are intimidated. Um, you can just go into the voice chat and and mute yourself. And then Tara, you just send me an email scam slam 411 at gmail.com and you get instructions you know if you just want to sit in there and listen um for a while to see what the conversation is um and see what if it's interest if it's interesting to you or if you want to jump in or not um that's fine you can you can just sit in there and listen if you would like and stay on mute so if you're doing that in there then how is that spreading awareness um i was listening to the voice chat while i was cooking dinner so and i was getting up to speed with yeah and we with spread each. awareness all the time Ooh. we don't have to do <laughs> awareness every fucking breath of every goddamn day oh bearded comedy has been giving us resistance for the last 48 hours he's You're probably allowed the he looks like relax. florida man well no We're i'm not in there relax. discussing anything personal or anything either i i was in there because lisa was live and i could not live stream because i was cooking dinner and so I was listening in, listening and watching to the Lisa live stream on the on the voice chat on mute. So that way I could catch up with what was going on with Lisa and not have to try to catch up later. I was listening right. to it while I was cooking, um, but I can't live stream here. You know, I can't live stream at my stove. I mean, I could, but that'd be, right. you know, so. Yeah. Uh, Awareness, yeah, and, you know, clout, you clout. Oh. What's the box really quick? How do I? I'd love to know how I get clout from a Discord. You mean claw? <laughs> Wrong word. Florida, it's yeah. claw, not clout. Claw, claw. <laughs> not clout, claw. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need a. I don't need clout or a claw. I don't need either one of those. I really the don't. Claw. Who steals claw machines? <laughs> How petty do you got to be to go around robbing claw machines from Walmart? <laughs> Not a very good criminal. What is your life about, buddy? Um, honey, I, I made um, chicken fried rice and some uh, egg rolls. Thank you, I know, I know you're out of Florida. I know where you are. Don't play me, buddy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you're you, an idiot. <laughs> you're in the corner of an apartment somewhere. Just let me know how that flesh is in the corner of an Go away now. Now I'm blocking him. Now I'm blocking him. Can I block him? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. La, da, 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 da. There he is. And then hit mute after that. Oh yeah, the dinner was good. It was pretty good. We're good. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Oh, Deborah wanted to do it. Darn. Oh, I'm sorry. So I never get to do it. I never chance. get to do it. I'm sorry. I'll let you get the next one. <laughs> I'll let All you get right, the next so let's two. take a break for now so that way we can get some other behind the scenes stuff accomplished that we need to do and um hopefully we'll have um some good content organized for you for when we come back, okay? Yes. Are we a definite oh, for this good? evening, ladies? What? Wait, what? Are we a definite for this evening? Yeah, I just don't know an exact time because I'm not okay. sure how long okay. it's gonna take. But... Yeah, we've just got some shit to deal with. Gotcha. A lot, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. All right. So we will talk to everybody later. And you might see us also on the disco because I'll be in and out of there um, doing approvals and stuff. And I might pop in and just check on yeah. what's going on here and there. Yeah. See the fam in the disco. <laughs> all right. Uh, so I will I will see you all you all of you later. Thank you for your support. And um, everybody.